Hello and welcome back. So this is insanely exciting. The science beta is here. I believe this is an open beta where the science will slowly get rolled out over the next two weeks. I don't know for certain though. Um, but this is going to be Fluffy Princess Productions account. Be sure to swing on over to her. She already has her video out. Go ahead and toss her a sub as well. She's really close to a thousand. That means a battle party. But let's go ahead and see. Here we have English. We have math and science over here where it says math and then science and then so we have this this English which is going to be the same base game if you if you have the math and science as well then there's going to be more that you can do within prodigy English as well I believe there's new items and stuff um so that's one of the perks of the ultra membership um for the math and the science there are two different game game modes that you can enter it's going to be within the same world now as this starts out um uh, uh, it'll probably start out in a particular way, but then branch out much in the way that Prodigy English has done. It started out as the base game that had the curriculum uh, and everything, and now it's really turned into a multifaceted sort of game and adventure. Um, uh, so, so I believe that the science will probably follow the same path. We're going to take a look and see what is in here, and first we're going to start off by reading the descriptions. So for Learn Math, it says solve math problems, battle monsters, and earn rewards. For Learn Science, it says answer science questions as you explore new adventures. So it looks like eventually we'll probably be leading into different things, science-based things that you can do within the math world, within the prodigy wizard world. Um, and uh, but for right now, it's going to be sort of ironing out how the actual questions, how the how the uh, curriculum works and operates to make sure it's the smoothest as possible. Exactly in the same way that English happened, I believe this is this is all me talking, by the way. So uh, let's go ahead and click play right here and see what happens. I am so excited by this, guys. I love it. So you can see this is M Emily Magic Petals account. And the uh, image for Ultra looks absolutely gorgeous. I love it. I love the fact that now we have the science curriculum. Let's click next here. All right, we're going to go to more worlds. And of course, you know where I'm going to go, right? Let's come on over to a granite here. We're entering the world. All right, and here we are. Emily Magic Pedal is right here. Hello, Ross Davalt. Hello, Andrew Ironblade. Great to see you guys. Let's we're gonna get into a small battle here. I don't know. I don't know how many attacks we're gonna get and love love all of the different uh, pet gear that we're wearing. Okay, so this is this says uh, does this traffic light communicate with light or sound? Now the actual image that we see is very similar to that of Prodigy English. I don't know if the uh, math will also get revamped to look like this or not, or if math is going to stay the same. Um, I, I I really like the way that the math looks with all the tools and stuff. So I think. If we, if the tools were implemented into this design, then it probably wouldn't look quite like this. So I like this. So does this traffic light communicate with light or sound? You could do light, sound, or neither. Well, we use lights to see it. Let's listen. Does this traffic light communicate with light or sound? I A. Forgot. Light. B. Sound. C. Neither. I forgot how serious this man sounded. I love that guy's voice. It's awesome. It communicates with light. So let's go ahead and check our answer. There's a little scroll button as well. That's correct. Make uh, Practice makes learning better. Awesome. So there we go. That was very nice. I enjoyed that. Let's go ahead and clobber. There you go, buddy. Awesome. Awesome. All right. So here we are with that that is quite smooth quite smooth so as we battle it's gonna be just like battling normal monsters here um and eventually it seems as though there's going to be new areas where we can sort of explore and check out and see so uh new adventures that are probably science science-based ventures uh, one of the things that i would love to see this is just me kind of prattling on so that the questions are going to work exactly like that uh i'll try to get into one more battle before um we wrap things up but i would love for these stores that are just kind of sitting here to be like a way for um 
a way for us to go ahead and learn a little bit more about science. So maybe this is like biology and we could go in and learn about bodies and plants and other things like that. This is that this would be like um, potion mixing or something since we have sort of the, the spell book. I think that would be really, really neat to go ahead and incorporate some of the areas here into that. And then, you know, maybe have an area at uh, the academy to go study. You know, that would be really neat to have a um, royal high vibe or even a... Um, uh, oh adventure academy type thing going on with that having having the subjects kind of there so uh, that would be really neat to kind of branch off into that sort of environment i don't know if there are going to be different maps or other things happening uh as we go along but um it would be very interesting to uh to uh uh see how this changes how how the um uh, prodigy science sort of evolves. I'm really excited to find that out. So if you noticed that there were some glitches in prodigy math or things were running a little slower, it's because these awesome questions are, were being loaded inside. So of course, just like with Dragon Isle, uh, let's go ahead and start out with some darkness. Da, 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 da. Uh, with Dragon Isle, we had um, uh, so, some slowdowns, some glitches, and a period where it needed, where we needed to go ahead and figure out how everything was working out before things could get rebalanced. So this is all sound here, unless you'd like to... I guess the band is like smiling and stuff, so I'm going to go with both. I don't know if that's correct or not. Let's. Uh, although, it wouldn't be light. They're not shining lights at us. There's no light show. So that would be just a sign. Uh, so that would just, just be uh, sound. Um, so there will probably be a period where we get some adjustments and some some uh, tweakings and some figurings out. As always, when I get information about um, the progression of Prodigy Science and how it's going to work out, then we'll go ahead and see, um, uh, and I'll pass that information on to you. Which helps us see better? What picture has more light? Picture A definitely has more light than the lighthouse, although the lighthouse uh, helps us <laughs> to go ahead and make sure we don't run into stuff. All right, let's do Dark Globe now and finish off our forest caller here. Boom. And I'd like to give a thank you to uh, Fluffy Princess Productions for allowing me to use her account to showcase this map, this uh, science stuff, which is awesome. Uh, light helps us see better which picture has less light. This has less light. There's probably more lights on than here, but the cumulative effect of the light would be less at night. All right, and we're doing Grim Burst here. Boom. That's awesome. All right, so yeah, the questions are quite nice. We were going over um, uh, lights and sound, the differences between our senses and what our senses perceive uh, with these questions. When I'm able to go ahead and see what topics are covered, I will also pass that on to you. Uh, the teacher accounts don't appear to be uh, loaded or updated with this yet. It takes a little while for all that stuff to happen. Um, and so really, really excited at the possibilities of this uh, game mode and um, that there's science curriculum built into here as well um, and also of course for the perks you do get to get 880 more magic coin per month um, I should probably wait for fluffy princess productions to collect that correct correct so um, but the 880 uh, uh, magic coin per month you will be getting here in game um, and uh, then you will also be able to go ahead and get some extra perks in prodigy English as well so it looks this this is really really cool I love the fact that the science is embedded in there and um, I for, for what you get out of it, I think it's quite a bit, um, especially as the story kind of progresses and uh, we see what is added to science, which I'm really excited to find out a little bit more. This is super, super exciting. I was under the impression we were going to have to wait for a year. Um, Prodigy is doing such a great job of fast tracking all of this stuff. So be sure to like, be sure to subscribe, uh, swing on over to Fluffy Princess Productions video and say thank you to her. And uh, we will be back with more fun and more content really really soon prodigy science is here woohoo <laughs> all right have a good one guys take care keep on prodigying on whether it's math science or english bye bye